Education Minister Rakam A. Sangma provided an update today on the current status of the Captain Williamson Sangma State University. He mentioned that the recruitment process is nearing completion and will be finalized after the conclusion of the Modal Code of Conduct. Similarly, applicants for the Vice Chancellor position will be considered post MCC. The minister expressed optimism about commencing the academic session from 2025 onwards. Look, now we are already, and we have already, uh, the process of I mean, recruitment is almost completed. However, uh, after the MCC is over, we will uh, shortlist the uh, applicants for by chancellor post, and after due process, uh, of course, some technical issues still there, and we will sort it out soon. And after the MCC is over, we will let you know, uh, and the shortlist is almost completed, and we will take the due process and will be completed soon. So the cathedrals uh, will be both in Shillong and Tura, or what is it? Yes, uh, no, the headquarters is in Tura, the, because the, the, what you call the campus, but uh, what you call the Shillong campus will also be there at the same time. But however, uh, so it seems, it looks like this academic session 2024 may not able to start with, because there are lots of the process to be followed. After the appointment of the vice chancellor, the register has to be appointed, the department has to be created, and the uh, curriculum, the framework, the constitutions, all this board have to be uh, constituted and we have to, the lots of process to be followed. I think maybe it looks like in 2025 onwards, we may able to take the admission for the postgraduate post and uh, for courses in uh, Captain Williamson Sangma State University. The Education Minister also responded to inquiries about whether colleges in the state will affiliate with the state university. Additionally, he revealed plans for the state university to include tribal studies in its curriculum. You look, this depends on the ins institution's decision also. There may be some colleges which they will be appellating to state university. There are many degree colleges will be appellating to uh, state university. And there are already many colleges already appellated to Northeastern Hill University, which is a central university. So it may depend on the uh, some colleges whether they will continue with the uh, Nehu or they will uh, affiliate with the state university. So we may uh, we will decide later on whether we may give them optional or they will all will be affiliated to state university. We will decide later. On. Sir, uh, Nehu is a central university, and so long colleges are affiliated to Nehu. Yeah. If they uh, get themselves affiliated to state university. What will be the advantage? Look, uh, look, this like this. So, like sometime, uh, yes, we have both merit and demerit. If we appeal to the central university, of course, we we see a different status. But if we stay in the state university, it, nothing different is there. But we will be having the same course, maybe the different, maybe better than that also. We will be priming it. It depends on the, how we proceed with the entire, what you call, framework and the entire, what you call, development of the courses of the things. Because we will be having, uh, state university will be having some department which, is, which, which, which may be the first one in the country also. We are planning to uh, set up some department like uh, travel research department which will because the the travel studies is a need of the hour 